from the people that planted their plants, which all of us did one, right? And if this is yours, raise your hand. Awesome. Good job, Liam. And if this is yours, raise your hand. Awesome, Georgia. Good job. So, I just happen to have a boys and girls. Just coincidence, you know. Do you notice something? It's kind of interesting because this one hasn't really grown that much, right? But this one, wow, look at that. It started as something. Yeah. And it's grown and it's grown and now even has a little bit of the lima bean on the outside of it, okay? So it's starting to produce some things. Um, I want to talk with you guys a little bit. I want to see how much you remember from our plant life cycle lesson. First of all, I want for you to tell me with your hands, yes or no, I want you to tell me, did you like that lesson? Did you like learning about the plant life cycle? I did. I learned some things. We can always learn something new, right? And did you feel like it was useful to the rest of the unit? Do you feel like by learning the plant life cycle that you really now know more about plants? Yes or no? Good. Excellent. So somebody tell me, I want to make sure when we create a lesson and when we teach you guys, when I teach you guys, and when we learn about things together, then we want to make sure, we always want to go back and make sure, did we remember what we originally learned about? Do we remember and can we put it into practice even now? So, when we talked about our objective, what was, does anybody remember, what was our objective when we were talking about the plant life cycle? What was it? Cash, do you remember? That is the plant life, plant life cycle itself. That's good. You already know it. But we're talking about what did we say we could do? When we got to the end of our lesson, we should be able to do something. We should be able to do something now. What was it, Lily? Put the plant life cycle in order. Awesome job. So it was an I can statement, right? I can, you can, say I can. I can. Put the. Put the. Plant life cycle in order. Plant life cycle in order. Okay, let's do it one more time. I can. I can. Put the. Put the. Plant life cycle. Plant life cycle. In order. In order. Awesome. And I love the way that you guys are paying attention, even as I have my back to you, and even as I'm writing. It makes me so super happy. You're doing a fabulous job. Thank you. Wow, so that's what was written up here before, and that's what we have now. And that's something that I know you can put the plant life cycle in order. So um, let's talk about, first of all, really quickly, though, how does this relate to other things in life? How does this relate to, let's do some thinking. Let's put our thinking caps on. Okay, so everybody take imaginary cap, put it on. Okay, how does this relate to other cycles in life? What, what can we apply from what we learned here to other life cycles? Yes? Whale life cycles. Yeah, so tell me a little bit about that. Well, whale life cycles, um, they always eat krill and go to different places. And the, and the krill lives in ice water, and then they go to ice water, and then they have their baby in early winter. And then does the baby eat krill? Yeah, so the cycle repeats, right? Just like we talked about before that the cycle repeats. It's the same thing with the well life cycle. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of the team. Everything is awesome. So, what are some of the life cycles that you guys can think about? What are some things that you can think about of life cycles? Yeah. The butterfly life cycle. The butterfly life cycle. Awesome. Layla. A horse life cycle. Awesome. Yes. A snake life cycle. Awesome. <gasps> Bella. Dinosaurs. Okay. Awesome. Ryder. Walruses. Walruses. Okay. Make sure you're giving me five. So, what we're going to do now is I want to see on a test. I'm going to test your brain. I want to see how much you remember of the plant life cycle, Liam. Life cycle in order on the paper. So 
Think about in your mind, what's going to go first? What's going to go second? What's going to go third? What's going to go fourth? And you have to give it a title, right? So think about in your mind, what would the title be? So we're going to, I'm going to test your knowledge and see how much you remember. I know you guys remember this. We're going to see if we achieved our objective, right? To put the plant life cycle in order. And to add that knowledge to other things that we learned about plants and other life cycles that we will be learning about because we're going to be learning about spider life cycle, butterfly life cycle. So right now, quietly tiptoe back to your desk and let's start. Get started right away. Whichever table is doing the very best job, then I'm going to give some points.
element individually, I want to know if we can fill them in together, okay? So, what goes first? Raise your hand if you know what goes first. Layla. The seed. Seed. So, I'm going to write the word seed. So, E. Yep. I'm going to drop a term of seed. What comes next? Liam. Seedling. That seed grows in the soil and it becomes a seedling. And then, what comes next? A mature plant.